Good morning, everyone. <clears throat> it is a Sunday, March 31st, 2019. And we are getting ready to take a walk around, show you. Oh, we don't want that one. My bad. Here. That one? Yep. Show you what I got done yesterday and uh, what the plans are for today. You guys stay out of my compost. Give me that. No, you give me that. Give it here. How'd you get that? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. So, uh, yesterday I got the end of the mulch in. And that completed that one line. And gave me two buckets to kind of go this way. Um, I just wanted to fill in up against the rock area that we're creating here so that they don't um, kick rocks all the way out into the yard that I have to rake back. So hopefully that mulch will kind of <laughs> kind of hold things together. So we still need another load. Like I said, it'll be 15 yards for just that side of the yard. Um, I got a bunch of the weeds pulled up. There are... Oh, I don't even know if you can tell this on the video, but... That's all crabgrass. When we're pulling back the plastic, crabgrass has crawled all across the ground. It's not real deep. Ah, uh, that's awesome. I got a woodpecker on, oh, there it goes, my bad. Woodpecker on the roof, tapping. Okay, but it crawls all along the ground and it's not real deep here, so I'm able to, um, use my tool and actually get it up so I cleaned up this whole area over here and moved the rock that was here on this semicircle that they created um, and moved it over to our walk path area that will go from uh, the back porch um, basically on the side of the tree and out to the gate I needed to do that as well because that's where my uh, last post is going to go for the garden area. So I got this whole dug. I just protected it with a bucket because I didn't want the dogs to get hurt. But I got this whole dug for the next post. Um, I'll get done today. And then... Um, I need to clean the weeds out of this area over here with my tilling. You totally got into my compost bad, man. Damn it. Ugh. So, anyways, I'm sorry. Clean up the weeds over here um, so that the rest of this rock that's there can come over in front of the compost and act as a walkway that will come up the yard and meet up with the rock right there by the um, ironwood tree. But it's gonna open all this area here for in-ground um, planting. So I think that that's the major goal for today um, is getting this, especially with them getting in my compost, getting this uh, closed off so that they don't have access over here anymore. I thought my compost was working well, but my barrier is not working. So, gotta get that done, and then um, I have to build the gate for the for the garden. Um, I don't know that that'll happen today, that might happen tomorrow, but I need to get that built and into place so that they are blocked from back here. Um, I know I have to clean up, and what I mean clean up is just trimming and trimming these posts out, and then whatever we don't use today, because I only need two, whatever we don't use today, I'm going to just set aside for um, the expansion when that happens. Um, I don't know if that'll be this year or next, but huge things coming, huge. I gotta get that back in the house, too. Um, yeah, and then, 
once this area is completed and the gate is put up and they can't get in here anymore, I'm going to work on um, cleaning this whole area out. Oh, dude. Um, I need to move all this stuff off of the rocks so that we can pull the plastic back and get these rocks all moved out of here. Um, whether if we need them all to go into this area or not, I'm not sure. Whatever's excess though, I'll probably transport out to the, out to the front yard just so it's out of the way back here. Um, I'm gonna keep a little bit down for the lawnmower to sit on underneath my um, work table that we built. <clears throat> out of scrap two by fours and a piece of wood I scalvage, salvaged, scavenged, salvaged, whatever. Um, yeah, I keep my lawnmower in there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, you can. I keep my lawnmower in there just so that the um, rain doesn't get to it or the snow. So, um, yeah, that's a. Another full day's work over just in this area because I got to move rocks too. And then once I get this area ready and get the rocks moved, I'm going to transplant that one bush that um, Barrett and Sam seem to love to eat because it is coming back. Um, it's the one that I don't know what it is. It gets really big though. Oh, jeez, that hurts. Oh. Um, yeah, so that's it. That's what we got going on today. It's a beautiful day. Um, I need to go in the house and check the UV rating for the day because yesterday we had a really low UV rating and it was very comfortable to work out here for an extended period of time. But um, the day before I know the UV rating was at an eight and it was actually really difficult to stay out here while it was um, in the heat of the day. It was just very intense, even though it was only like, I wanna say it was like 72 or 73, something like that, but man, it felt like it was 90 to me, at least. Um, so, trying to keep up with that as well and check on that before we go full throttle and <clears throat> um, overdo it. All right, so that's what we got going on in the garden. Um, I hope you guys have a great day. Take care. God bless you, and we'll talk to you soon. All right? All right. Bye.